Hello everyone, this is Dr. Ergin. I'm an endocrinologist, diabetes specialist, and a metabolism expert. Today, I'm going to talk to you about something very practical. I get this question all the time, and people really don't know the answer to that. So the question is, where can you get rid of your needles, the pen needles, or the needles for syringes? So you use them, and then you're like, uh, well, what am I going to do with this needle? Now, you don't want this needle to be around the kids because, you know, God knows what the kids are doing. You don't want the needle to go to the floor or someone picking up the trash. You don't want them to get poked, especially, you know, with the diabetes and blood and you don't want to deal with that. And, uh, of course, you don't want to hurt anybody else, Not even, even if it's not in your family, you don't want them, that needle to be hazardous. So, there are appropriate ways to get rid of uh, pen needles. One of the things you can do is ask the pharmacist to give you a needle container. Uh, you can purchase that, but actually you can make this a lot easier and cheaper for yourself. So, if you are ever washing your clothes, and I hope you do, in this case, <laughs> uh, you will eventually run out of it, right? So when you run out of detergent, then basically you have an empty container. And what you can do, you can use that empty container, and their lids are pretty solid. So you put your needle in there, and you close the lid pretty tight and you know the kids are generally not going to be able to open that and of course you don't want to leave that under your sink you want to leave that somewhere safe where the young kids cannot reach out your grandsons grandkids uh, if you're older but bottom line is using a container like that will save you a lot of headaches and money and then of course you just take that container you don't have to put into anything extra just take that you put it into your regular trash and g get rid of it that way so I hope uh, that helps you guys and we'll see you in the next video.